Hello everybody, welcome back or welcome if you're new. Today, I'm gonna start decorating for fall. We're gonna start in the kitchen. I think this is the first year that everything just kind of came to me and I just started decorating and put things out. Uh, I don't think that's ever happened. Usually I'll tweak after like a half an hour, but I haven't tweaked yet. Doesn't mean I might not. So anyway, uh, I try not to go too overboard with pumpkins, but they're definitely, and you'll see some in a minute, are um, a few touches. I've tried to kind of um, sort of elevate my style a little bit. Uh, I did already clean the counters to save a little time, and let's get going. All right. Um, I have this bowl here that I got a long time ago from Hobby Lobby. Actually, it was like in their spring shop on sale. But I'm just going to put some white pumpkins in there. Come over here, and I'm just going to put this tray out, okay? I've had this for a while. I'll put my pumpkins here. I got this acorn a long time ago. Can I sh show you something? I know. If you've been watching me for a while, I did show this a long time ago. But you know what, guys? I can't get rid of it. Look at how cute it is. I'll have to find another one. But for now, hopefully my mints don't fall out. I actually have mints and gum in there. Okay, I'll do that. And then I have a vase that I kind of had to finagle with a little bit. Um, things weren't staying too great. So I did already kind of put them in so you didn't have to see me zhuzhing them and moving them around here and there. These three I had bought in a glass vase, I think from Marshall's, and they were tied together, and I just happened to... I think it was last year, I just took them apart. I have this little plate, and I love this glass soap dish. Look at the detail, the little ribbon. Uh, I'm gonna put it on a little dish. I'm gonna put it right over here. And guess what? We're done with that counter anyway. So let me take you in a little bit closer. Oh, by the way, I already put a tray up there. I got that at Dollar General. I'm trying to stay away from some of the signs, but sometimes you can't help it. So I thought that came out really pretty. Um, when it gets into later fall, I don't know, I'm gonna have to change out my sunflowers, I think. And there's the soap dish. Yeah, I thought that came out nice. All right, now on to the next counter. All right, so what we're gonna do here is I'm gonna put a breadboard. I'm gonna hide the outlet. Sometimes you can do it, sometimes you can't. I've got a nice um, black cookbook. I took the cover off and I love how the black kind of ties in with my counter and other different things. Okay. And this here, I just plopped in one of these. <laughs> so I forgot to take my purple sticker off. Keeping it real here, everybody. But I loved this. I found this at the Goodwill. Look at the detail on the side. I really like that. So I think it's, well, not that side because the purple sticker, I'll take it off after. I think it's supposed to go like that maybe those are on the sides but i'm i'm going to show that detail i don't know anyway we'll do that we just make sure this goes in move this over a little bit put the plant there i could put it in the front that might look cute too but i sort of like how the cookbook shows so we'll just do that and then i ended up getting this at home goods absolutely love it um, I didn't know if it was something I would buy, but I kept going back to it. Uh, it was a hard decision where to put it. I could have put it in the middle of my dining room table, my, my island over there, the counter. Um, so I'm not sure if I will be switching it, but for now I'm going to put it here. Great for entertaining, right? If you have company, for sure. Um, I love the, the, all the details. So pretty. So anyway, we're going to put that like that. I've got a little set of fall napkins. Put up the top. Slide that in there. And I got these at Goodwill. Tend to like the gold, although I did rust in my family room, but a little bit of uh, gold tones in here. They've got pumpkins on it and uh, a little bit of detail. I'll show you up close. I came in a set of three. Just place those like that. And a plain pumpkin without going too overboard. Okay. So in this corner, I always kind of keep this the same. 
Um, this was at Goodwill, has the apples on the other side. Supposedly it was made in Italy. Um, so anyway, I don't want to use the apples. I like this. I think it has more. You know what? I think I'm going to chip that, everybody. Mm -hmm. um, I think it has more of a kind of a European, I don't know, look. I, I think it just looks a little prettier without the apples, at least for now. All right, I've got my breadboard. I usually stick over here. I've got to be careful it doesn't actually fall. So I, I could leave it like this. Um, but you know, I keep it real on my channel and that's where my onion goes. <laughs> I'm sure you guys have seen that before if you've been with me for a while. So that is how that counter came out. I'm still not sure if I want the plant in the front of the cookbook or in the back. I don't know, decisions, decisions. Let's see, because I do kind of like how that, let's see. I don't know, guys. I, I kind of like it to the side. I really do. Let's keep it like that for now. Yeah, you never know. I could switch it. Okay, that's good for now. All right. On to the next spot. All right, so next we're going to do uh, my stove and we'll do my coffee counter there. I've got another one of these plates, like the one near the sink. And I think I got this at like Dollar General. The little leaf looks cute. I'm just gonna light it, but I'm not sure. That wick just came out, let's see. I gotta hold that still, there we go. There. A little ambiance going there. And then um, for the stove, I just have this dish towel. It's got some gourds and pumpkin and stuff. Just hang that there. So it looks like that. Yeah. All right, let's head over here. I've got everything kind of ready, but not together. So let's see. So every year I usually have put this mug out, all the cozy vibes. I just think it stands out pretty. It's so funny because every year I say, oh, I'm gonna be really, really neutral. And next thing you know, I just bring out the typical fall colors. They're just so pretty. And I just love it against my neutral backdrop. So I have this tray, got this a long time ago. I love all the detail. I put that over here in the corner. Got my carry cups in here. Move to this side. Got that there. And then I'm just gonna put a little, um, the Target mug, I'm sure you've seen that, Joanna Gaines, I love that. Yeah, I've got some wooden spoons. I went to get the ones at Hobby Lobby that had the pumpkins on the top. They didn't have them. They had sunflowers, but I'm like, eh, kind of wanted the ones with the pumpkins. And that's that. I'll show you everything at the end, of course. And that's my simple coffee bar. All right, and for my... I think I'm gonna move this stool out of the way a little bit. For this counter, uh, I'm gonna use a tray. I often put a tray here. Uh, it's just something I do. I feel like anything here without something under it looks a little bare because the counter is busy and kind of blends in. Uh, but anyway, we've got this tray with the nice black handles. I like how it blends in with my counters. I'm gonna put a little light on for ambiance. I don't know if we really need it, but maybe just to show you. <laughs> and I've got this, um, I don't, I'm trying to think where I got this. this wheat? I don't remember. And I just added a simple ribbon because it just had the tie. It looked a little bit on the boring side. So we'll do that. And then I have, I love this dish towel. I think I got it at Joanne's a long time ago. The little pom-poms. And I've used that before. And then this little leaf dish. I bought some candies. Of course, they have to blend in, right? <laughs> the little wrappers. These need to be spaced out, I think, a little bit a little bit more. Let me just. There we go. That looks a little bit better. And then over here we've got kitchen closed. I did have that in my last um, video. I forgot which what it was about. But anyway, we're gonna keep that. This also is gonna stay here for now. Might tweak this later on. 
Um, I'm just going to plop some napkins. And I do use these a lot, these faux cupcakes. You can get these on Amazon. It says Sweets Paradise. Uh, but they have breads, loaves of French, like French-looking baguettes. Oh, my goodness. It's, it's amazing. They all look so real. So... I know I used this before, but it just kind of looks cute there. And for now, um, we're just going to leave it like that unless I can think of something. I could have put pumpkins in there, but I, I just didn't want to go overboard with the pumpkins because that would have looked cute, a couple of them. So who knows what I'll change it to. But anyway, that's that. All right, just a quick overview of what we did today. If you're new, I hope you like what you've seen today. Please consider um, liking the video and subscribing to my channel. That would really help me out. More content coming, of course. We have to decorate my dining room and my family room for fall, as well as some touches in my bedroom. So please come on back, everybody. All right, so yes, I did tweak something. I switched trays. I put this one that was on the other counter over here. It seemed like it was more suited for this area. And look at there, guys. Look at the little uh, candle. Little, I put a little tea light in there. All right, so I thought that looked good. And I put the round tray over here, and I think that looks good. All right, everybody, have a great day, and hope to see you soon.